so the day she was born let's say it was the month of march and we had a lot of aspirations that whether it would be a boy or a girl and then when the doctor came and said that oh it's a girl so we were elated to the hilt and we felt that okay god has blessed us with an angel daughter our world changed totally that day full of energy yeah like, just a friend you want to hang out with all the time because they just lift you up you yeah. know it's and it's always positive yeah, i think i think prachi is definitely one of the people that we've all had um our biggest laughs with you know we were streaming down our faces just dying of laughter and prachi is definitely i think for all four of us um, if you're being whiny about something she'll be like pick me up take me for coffee we'll go we'll chill we'll listen to music we'll be fine like that's just been her <laughs> Hey Prachi, how are you? Good morning. How are you all? I'm very excited to see Shabam. I cannot wait to meet my extremely airport anxious group. Twenty twenty. No. Hmm. Come back. to tell her, I think I don't have any boyfriend kisi ko dhoonda nahi kya 4 saal boston mein reh ke kiya kya you know every day she used to talk on the phone raat ko 12 baje 1 baje fir ek din maine usko pucha aur usse kaha ji kaun hai yaar ye mera boyfriend hai aisa chhod do kahan boyfriend leke aayi hai i took it very lightly and i thought nahi nahi ye ladki koi boyfriend wali nahi hai you know then uh, like then she told me that yeah he is the man of the man. i like him and one day he just I mean, she just got her home. <laughs> when I spoke to him, and then I realized that uh, you know he was not a man who would be insisting his views on her. So at this young age, youth decides to share or give enough space to each other as partners. I like this quality of both of them. the approach the attitude of shubham was excellent sachivan sukh mai ho mangal mai ho kya baat hai first i was surprised i was like ye ladki pyar kare not the scene she was full you know apne duniya mein mast in her own zone what is love ho to hota rehta hai hota rehta hai and suddenly she comes and says she's all serious about a guy and plus well, i think i should get married and i was like what are you talking like are you serious you won't get married to shut up you're still a kid who are you start thinking about these things but then it just become real and now i'm here at the wedding and things are happening it's all like did 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 seems like it's still not so tin <laughs> But yeah, I think so. It's going to be a good life for her. I'm sure it's it's a new one, a new journey. much about Shubham for the simple reason that I know what she chooses she chooses and as i said over the years we realize choose happiness over anything else so um i think Shubham is happiness for her and she really finds a happiness in him and i'm sure he's a, he's a great guy he's lovely to be with lovely to speak to it was always my idea that i'd love to have someone with me from india because i've lived outside of india for so long when i met prachi she was she was the one that she was perfect uh, someone who was indian and uh, it wasn't someone where you know someone comes from in, outside of india and then meets a random person i had some common ground with her already yeah. i'm just lucky it's what my name means and i've been lucky in my life and uh, she's the biggest part of it It feels real that I'm here. I 
can't believe that my six year relationship is finally gonna be a beautiful, beautiful wedding. We never dated when we were in Boston, of course. But we just enjoyed each other's company because no matter how much whatever anyone said, yeah. my nights from 12 to 5 were dedicated to this boy that I was smitten by. Not because he spoke too much, but because in his presence, I could talk a lot. He was always listening. That being around her, it, it entangles you with love. And then there's no better way to live than having someone next to you who constantly teaches you what caring and love is about. From what I know of him in Boston, from just being a girl who was smitten by this guy, to falling in love with a man who I appreciated for his sense of humor, his heart, his, his need to always be there taking care of me. Oftentimes I would like cry to my best friend saying like, oh my god, he's, he's not here, he's, he's just not there, I don't know how to deal with it. But then I suppose he just called me around that time and he's like, what's up, what's wrong, you know, why are you being so like sad about it. Wow, what's up? I'm, I'm right here. We can always be on call. You know, those things like when you start realizing that that's, that's what you want to have for the rest of your life. That's what you want to be married to. You know, that's what you want to have and hold and call your husband and be called his forever. So I think those are some of the things that I went from just being smitten by a guy to like being madly in love with this man, with this beautiful, beautiful boy. She wants anything to be changed, I'm open to that. But the way she is, she's perfect. Prachi just glow. Even if she's not like constantly smiling, there's just like this this energy about her when he is around. And I just feel like he lifts her up in the best ways. Whenever you know she's looking at him, there's just like this this inherent joy within her. Just like even just like looking at Shubham, it's it's so epic. We come from different communities. We are uh, from different parts of the world, different backgrounds, different people in some way. But uh, we managed to get married, we fell in love and uh, coincidentally we got married on the 14th of February. It's a perfect example of falling in love. Without her, our home is not going to be the same. And with her being so far away now, I don't know, it's just going to be 
Oh my God, she's the life of my house, and of course I will definitely miss that in my house because she is the one who is like all the time, mom, mom, ye, wo, vina, ye, banao, wo karo. So definitely it's going to change. She's my world. She's everything. So hmm, it's going to be hard to let her go, but yeah. I know she's never going not far from here. I could never ask for a better sister than what I have, and what I will always have. And uh, sorry. Oh Fatu, what are you doing? I'm gonna miss my tutu so much. I'm gonna miss my overboiled spaghetti. always celebrated Valentine's Day with yeah. Rajri if nothing else like and he would always send her a bouquet to her office massive chocolates massive whatever yeah. it was like always a grand gesture and the fact that they're getting married on Valentine's Day